Good morning from the north shore of Lake Superior, Palisade Head. And we are here because my friend Joe showed me an awesome photo of a peregrine. He said he was having coffee in the morning with a peregrine. And uh, this is a traditional spot that they released peregrines here many years ago and now they breed here on their own. A uh, very safe spot, vertical cliffs ranging from like 50 feet to 300 feet high and just drops straight down to Lake Superior. Um, we're going to be very safe today, but uh, yeah, we're going to have uh, a shot at them maybe flying. I'd like to get some photos, some footage, um, thinking maybe they'll cruise along this cliff face. Um, but yeah, patience, patience, patience. Yeah, and I don't think I'll hang here, wait for the peregrine falcons. I guess there's um, a pair nesting on both ends of Palisade Head this year. No luck so far. But gorgidious day, song sparrows, white-throated sparrows, flickers, least chipmunk. They're a smaller cousin of the eastern chipmunk, and um, the stripes on the back are closer together, and they're smaller, hence the name, and they're more northerly at least in minnesota you only find them in the northeast part of the state Patience, patience, patience. So let's hurry up and wait. Well, I don't have a peregrine yet, but there's a common merganser male down there in the rocks. And when the sun's out, that water is just green. It just 
the color of the water just pops and uh, so I'm trying to shoot a little wider um, maybe um, you know, kind of a bird in the landscape shot very Minnesota very Palisade head very Lake Superior While I was waiting, I caught a glimpse of something flying out over the lakes and the pointy wings told me, yes sir, peregrine. And I, I scrambled, I got, uh, finally got on it, got focus, I was shooting slow motion video, 180 frames a second. And uh, yeah, that was uh, pretty cool. And then I kind of accidentally in this frame got <laughs> Baron coming in, I didn't even know it. I just had it on the tripod because he was making kind of flybys by the cliff. And this one too was an accident. I just got a few seconds of him coming around the corner of the cliff. But uh, pretty cool. Not the stunning close up view I was hoping for, but hey, any day you get to see a peregrine, especially below eye level is pretty cool. I will be back.